Moving on to other stories now, the U.S. Senate Foreign Relations Committee voted in favor of Mike Pompeo becoming the new Secretary of State. Although he needs full Senate approval to be confirmed, several Democrats said they will back the CIA chief, making his formal appointment this week highly likely. Park ji gets us up to speed with the developments. Members of the U.S. Senate Foreign Relations Committee cast their votes on Monday on current CIA Director Mike Pompeo's nomination for the Secretary of State. We will now move to the nomination of Mike Pompeo to be Secretary of State. Eleven voted in favor and nine opposed the nomination. It was a party line vote with all 11 Republican members supporting the nomination, while nine Democrats opposed on the grounds of Pompeo being too hawkish and over his past remarks about homosexuality and Islam. We were reporting to the floor in a positive manner. I want to thank members of this committee uh, for the diligence uh, they've displayed. Um, I think we've done the right thing to together. Pompeo now needs to gain final approval from the full Senate later this week to be confirmed as the new top U.S. diplomat. His nomination needs a simple majority out of the 100th seat Senate, where the Republicans enjoy a 51 to 49 majority. Watchers expect Pompeo will have no problem in getting the votes required to become the next U.S. Secretary of State, as three Democrats on the Senate have already said they will endorse him. As current CIA director Mike Pompeo met with North Korean leader Kim Jong-un earlier this month during his secret visit to Pyongyang to make arrangements before the projected summit talks between the U.S. and North Korea. Park Ji-won, Arirang News.